Do you know somebody with autism? Autism is much, much more common than most people think. About one in a hundred people have autism. That's more than 700,000 in the UK alone. So chances are that someone you know, or work with, or love has the condition. What is autism? Autism is a lifelong developmental disability that affects how we communicate with and relate to others. And it affects how we make sense of the world around us. Lots of things that people take for granted, like body language and metaphors, can be confusing and alienating for us. Autism is a spectrum condition, so that whilst we all share certain difficulties, our autism will affect us in different ways. Some of us have been to university and hold down jobs, whilst others need a lifetime of specialist support. Asperger's syndrome is a form of autism. People with Asperger's syndrome are often of average or above average intelligence. They have fewer problems with speech, but may still have difficulties with understanding and processing language. What is autism like? For us, the world can be a confusing mass of people, events, and places. Sometimes we struggle to make sense of the world, and this can make us anxious. Every person with autism is different. That's what makes it so difficult to understand. But some of the characteristics that we have include a love of routines, sensory issues such as noises or smells or light, and having special interests. Some of us experience difficulties in understanding and relating to other people, and having a social life can be that much harder for us. For some of us, for example, going to a party can be really hard because we don't know what's going to happen or who will be there, and it often gets too noisy, which can be upsetting. Other people with autism have trouble reading facial expressions, understanding jokes or sarcasm, or common phrases like, break a leg. Even phrases people use every day, like, it's cool, can be disorientating. You think they're asking you to turn the air conditioning off. Many people with autism don't look disabled. Parents of children with autism often say that people simply think their child is naughty. While we adults find that we are misunderstood, that is why it is called a hidden disability. What causes autism? The exact cause of autism is still being investigated, but research suggests that a combination of factors, genetic and environmental, may account for changes in brain development. Autism is not caused by a person's upbringing or their social circumstances. Is there a cure? There is no cure for autism, but there are interventions that enable learning and development which may be helpful. You can find out more by going to www.autism.org.uk forward slash approaches. Diagnosis. If you or someone you know thinks they have autism, they can contact their GP who can refer them to a specialist for diagnosis. So how can you help? There are many good people doing good work for autism up and down the country, but we need the support of the wider community. Together we can break down barriers. Together we can ensure that autism, which is far more common than other conditions that get far more attention, remains on the agenda. We hope that you will join us in helping more people with autism lead the life they choose. If you want to learn more about autism, go to www.autism.org.uk or click here. You can receive continuous news and information about autism by becoming a member of the National Autistic Society. As a member, you will receive your autism magazine quarterly, which includes news about autism, stories from people living with autism, practical tips, and much more. You will also receive regular e-newsletters, an autism alert card, and exclusive voting rights which help influence how the National Autistic Society, the leading UK charity for people with autism, can continue to help people with autism. Accept difference, not indifference. Thank you.